First, you put the copper and the zinc in a test tube. Then, you pour in the hydrochloric acid. As you can see, the zinc will immediately start to react with the hydrochloric acid, causing the zinc to disappear. The bubbles that are coming from the zinc are the reaction with the hydrochloric acid. The zinc will be gone in a few moments. And make sure, like shown before, not to heat it too much or the solution will start to boil. After again a few moments, bubbles will form and come out of the rubber tubbing in the tub with the water. It is important to let the first 15 or so bubbles go as they also contain air rather than just pure hydrogen. After the 15 bubbles, make sure to move the rubber tubbing exactly under the test tube. You can now see bubbles slowly filling up the test tube with pure hydrogen. After it is completely filled, we put a stopper on the test tube and take it out of the water.